Hey what's up people Virtual DJ has done it again it has done it again you know why the controller side it gives you so many chances of the controllers uh, but the difference now it has changed now a bit but for us we usually prefer using the keyboard like you can see here on the controllers it has given you so many things it gives you the points where i sit like you can see on my this uh, section here the crossfader zero percent uh, when i tap q so this is crossfader at zero percent e crossfader at a hundred percent and then effect one active at point z you can see these are all my custom mappings which you can see on this part and this is why i love virtual dj 2024 because now when you want maybe if for example you guys want to know which keys i'm using you can see at f1 this is sampler 27 which i play and then stop and then this side here it is sampler uh, you know this is sampler 233 play and stop and then up mute up uh, down is also mute this nudge this is where now you want if you want to beat match you are maybe your your tracks if you've not seen that video on how you can beat match also uh, please make sure you've tap this notification uh, card up on this virtual dj now at least you've learned about something about the controllers now let's go to the options and tweaks now on the uh, performance we can see you can uh you can try to put stem saved stems you can try manual you can try automatic like you see if you choose automatic uh if a prepared stems file should be saved automatically after real time separation this is when now you've load your song and it has done some things then uh what makes this virtual dj 2024 shine against the uh, predecessors uh is thus it gives us so many chances for example this option of stems we can see we have the vocals we have the instruments you have the bass you have the a cappella you have the kick you have the he heart stems and instruments so these types of stems what it just gives you it gives you an allowance on how to change or even separate maybe your vocals for the from the music you're using so uh, if you want vocals maybe vocals not to be hard you go uh, tap these vocals and then it's going to be put out and for example if you want instruments again to be put out you come here on the instrument then tap it so that it's it becomes unchecked also the bass also the a cappellas so that's how you can do it about the stems and then the most interesting thing about this virtual dj 2024 when it, when we get back to the interface it now gives you so many chances on how you can change your skins and the graphical interface for example we have the default which is a starter like if i select it you can see here this is the default you have two jog wheels around here and it's very simple you have the beat grid the pattern one pattern two scratch and samplers so that's the beginner now let's go to the uh, default essentials now you have some experience at least now you're going to have some you know some basics like for example the kicks now uh this one uh it just gives you maybe for example you want to separate maybe the kicks and the he heart also from uh, the first video I was like i was just uh telling you so let's go again to the default now this is the professional one uh if maybe you are now experienced at least you can do some changes like for example richie haniel you can uh, i mean you can load your song up there also on the left out there and it, it, like for example this, if this is the first time maybe you are you are installing your virtual dj 24 it might ask you this option the auto match key so for me i usually prefer okay this is okay but i usually don't prefer using the auto key because at some point maybe your song is playing at maybe a for example you can see the key is f here and the key in and this part uh i think it's not even f but i don't know where it it is supposed to be no okay this one is i think it is um the key here is dm yes the key here is dm so it's different from what we see uh, right here so uh that's more about the professional one and it gives you so many chances the bit grid uh the bit grid and also the uh the intents of the bit grid and the loop out for for, for example for me i usually prefer using uh, flanger and loop out and the bit grid but i usually don't prefer using this pro uh interface like the one you are seeing here i usually use prefer i'm, I'm usually i usually prefer using the old two decks like this one here 
So I usually prefer using this because it is very, very simple. Uh, the buttons are bigger. You can see what you, you are doing. You can interact with the keys directly. That's why I love the default option. Like you can see, it also tells you many options about uh, the keys you're using and the flangers. And uh, you, you see, it's just very easy to do that. You, you, you if we even see here, we have the strength. It has just given you some str that's the strength this is the speed of the flanger and for example if you want to use the bit grid you have the slot also for example uh, at some point if it's 65 bits 0.99 i usually prefer using it maybe at, at the middle side so uh, this is why i prefer using uh the old way of uh the 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 the, the, the what the virtual dj so there are so many effects here, the graphical interfaces you can choose on. So if you like those ones, you can try also this one for a starter. And let's go for the video overlay. We have uh, the, the skins. Now these are the skins. For example, if you want DJ virtual video, video skin 2018 edit, we have the lives, you have the for the broadcast. If you want it to happen, I mean to appear on your videos, you, you will always prefer choosing on one of these sides. We have also the remote sides. Like for example, if you want to put it on a tablet, I'll show you on my next video how you can connect your, I'm, I'm sure maybe if you're having problems with phone or tablet, I can show you on simply how to do that. So make sure you're subscribed to see more videos like that. So for those who maybe might be asking me the sound effects I usually use, I'll share with you on the link where you'll always access these sound effects. And uh, I think we shall, we shall be very, very happy about that. So anyway, guys, let's meet to the next video. It is your gay here, DJ Cliff. Bye. Bye. Love you guys.